Hi, I'm Scott Baird, President of Griffin Hill. We were asked to be the independent third party arbitrator in the Tahitian Noni $250,000 challenge. The basis of the challenge was this, that no other superfruit juice could rival Tahitian Noni bioactive beverages. And although many network marketing companies have products that they claim are made from superfruits, not one of them could match Tahitian Noni's impressive accomplishments. 14 human clinical studies, 52 scientific patents. It's been validated as a world-class adaptogen. There are 15 milligrams or more of iridoids in each recommended serving. It contains bioactives from a validated medicinal plant that remains stable for at least two years after processing and pasteurization. They have scientists on staff who have collectively authored over 35 peer-reviewed publications in scientific and medical journals. It also adheres to the World Anti-Doping Code and has been approved and certified by multiple independent laboratories. Four standards for a valid and reliable challenge include, are the terms of the challenge clearly stated? Was there adequate response time? Was there a substantially large inducement for participation? And finally, was the challenge widely published? Let's look at each one. Number one, are the terms of the challenge clearly stated? Well, we've just stated them again, and in Griffin Hill's analysis, those terms have been consistent and clearly stated throughout the length of time of the challenge. Number two, was there adequate response time? The challenge ran from March 1 to June 1 of 2010. This is a full 90 days of time to participate in and take up the challenge. There was clearly adequate response time. Number three, was there substantially large inducement for participation? Undoubtedly, $250,000 is a substantially large inducement for participation. But beyond the financial inducement is the greater social and market prestige inducement. It would be a great feather in the cap of any network marketing firm to be able to say that they not only met the challenge, but exceeded it. Number four was the challenge widely published. At the end of February, the $250,000 challenge was introduced at an international leadership conference in Anaheim, California. It was announced from the stage to thousands of independent product consultants. It was announced to all of the independent product consultants through emails, blog posts, Twitter, and Facebook. It was on the Tahitian Noni International website, and it was substantially published to all international search engines. It was sent out in multiple press releases over multiple wire services. It was picked up by hundreds of websites. As far as we can see, it was common knowledge in the network marketing industry. So, what were the results? Not one other superfruit company could prove that their signature product could rival Tahitian Noni Original. In fact, even with $250,000 on the line, no other company even came forward to be compared head-to-head -head with the new Tahitian Noni bioactive beverages. From what we have seen throughout the years, no one else compares. Tahitian Noni Original has now set itself apart from the superfruits of the world as a legitimate and validated bioactive beverage. It appears that no one else can make that same claim. In conclusion, here's the Griffin Hill official statement. Regarding bioactive beverages, Tahitian Noni International's scientific rigor among network marketing companies is unequaled.